Hi, everybody. I'm Mike Staver. This is Mondays with Mike, a weekly video series where I answer questions for people just like you. Here's this week's question. All in all, I'm a happy person. When I'm not a happy person, it worries me. How do I know when my unhappiness is something to be concerned about? We get questions like this often. We get, que- especially these days, don't we? We get questions about people wanting to know, you know, is this normal, not normal, so forth. And for those of you that are happy all the time, I get it uh, because you think that's normal, but it's not really normal to be happy all the time. I'm not saying it's abnormal. I'm just saying that there are very few people that are happy all the time. So, First of all, let me say that it's normal not to be happy sometimes. It's normal to be mad, normal to be unfrustrated, normally normal to be discouraged, normal to question what's it all about, Alfie? That's all normal. So the first thing you do is normalize variability. Let me say that again. Normalize emotional variability. It's completely normal. Now, if it's radical craziness, right? Like you're happy one minute, you're depressed the next minute, and you're, you know, burning cars the next minute maybe you could use a little little tune up right a little help but if it's what we call normal variability like kind of just you know the ebbs and flows like watching the ocean you know the tide comes in the tide goes out that's pretty normal so that's the first thing the second thing is to track um to kind of track the um, severity of it like in your moments of unhappiness or when you're not as happy does this make you feel uh, is it getting worse, right? Is it sort of trending down or does it not trend down? If it's just sort of the normal ebbs and flows, then I would actually be more concerned about you if you told me you were happy all the time. Um, and I'd want some of what you're taking. And, yeah, right. You know what I, say? <laughs> I think I'd want some of what that is. So normalize the ebbs and flows, manage or pay attention to how deep the dips are when you get them. If they're getting progressively more severe, then you probably want to talk to a counselor or talk to your doctor. And then the third thing is when you're not happy, just explore what it is. What is the itch? What is the angst that you feel so that we can, uh, so that you can sort of explore that uh, a little bit more. Probably somewhere in your life you learn that, you know, happy people are likable or, you know, are easier to be around. And sometimes that's true. Sometimes that's not. Hopefully that's, hopefully that's helpful. If you have a question you want to submit, send it to info at MikeStaver.com. That's info at MikeStaver.com. We're going to work it in to a session very soon. Don't forget to share Mondays with Mike on your social channels and in your networks. We certainly appreciate you watching. Until next time, take care.